Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel Salesforce Hunt. This is Rohit. I hope you are good and doing well. So today I'm going to show you how to reset auto number in Salesforce because auto number is predefined, you know, uh, fields or we can see the data type in Salesforce. So you can reset it or you can create as a new one based on your requirement. So if you are new in this channel, so please subscribe my YouTube channel for more updates and uh, please watch this video until end if you want to learn something new so let's get started without any further delay so right now I'm in my org so how to create the auto number and how to reset the auto number I will show you here for now let me click on this object manager let me create a new custom object so so for your better understanding purpose that's why I'm creating a new object let's say a student you can create any object as you want like a student and uh, let's say students and here create a uh, you know tab just click on the save so it's asking the style of the tab so let me choose any kind of you know style let's say airplane click on the next click on the next again and then save it so once you saved it now our object is created now so by default we have this kind of field created by last modify by owner student name right but I don't have any kind of you know uh, auto number or something like that so how to create that let me show you here so first of all let me create a new field here inside this object right and it's a kind of auto number click on the new and let's say student number for example purpose right so you start from one and format st means student and this is the format and I will start from zero like uh, zero 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 one uh, if you want to create a new record something like that like zero and click on the next click on the next again save it so once you saved it now you can see the auto number right this is the auto number so how to do the practical of this you know field so let me make it is duplicate here and under this app launcher you have to create a new student records there are so many you know records so you can easily get it now here so now click on the all create a new student here let's say student one click on the save and new student 2 and please observe once you click on this one now you can see student 1 having 0001 right and click on this one student 2 0002 right next will be 0003 you know very well this is the incremental number with the help of one we already set up under the our format right but how to reset this one suppose in your org right in your org you let's say you have lots of students right maybe thousands 500 or uh, like 10 students so how to reset this auto number that time you have to do one trick here so how to do that let me show you here so first of all now you can see student 1 having 001 st001 student 2 having this one that is called st0002 right but how to reset again because I need to start this number 001 if you want to create another new record so it will be 0003 right now but I need to reset this one so how to do that let me show you here so for now you have to do one thing just go to your object manager click on this field and relationship open that you know fields and just click on this you know field click on this added and click on this change field data type so this is the trick to change this data type to you know a uh, text field and after text field to uh, auto number this is the process so just let me change it as a text let me check here like text click on the next and click on the save right so once you save it now you can see it's the data type is the text right now but I need to check or I need to add auto number so again you have to do click on this add it change the field type and just you have to select auto number click on the next and now you can see it's automatic showing like 0001 and it start from 1 
so just click on the save again now it's auto number now and uh, please observe right now we have two student having the auto number name 0001002 right but I want to create a new stu student right now so you will be see like only 0001 not 0003 so let me create a new one let's say student 3 for example purpose click on the save and please observe now you can see it's automatic restart and reset the auto number st0001 previously you can see the sequentially like 1 2 3 4 something like that but I already change this you know auto number to uh, tax and tax to auto number that is the process to ch reset your auto number so here you can see this is 0001 new one right and you can see the three students here if you want to create new one so again you can see 0002 so student 4 click on the save button and now you can see 002 right so you can reset you can do anything as you want if you have like uh, predefined lots of uh, records earlier in this you know objects so you can generate that uh, auto number for that records as well so you can assign auto number or you can reset auto number based on your requirement right so this is the some trick about the auto number resetting power of this particular object you can use anywhere as you want let's say standard object or custom object it will be work to you so guys this is for resetting the auto number here so i hope you learn something new in this video if you like this video please like share comments and please subscribe my youtube channel for more updates so till then bye bye take care thank you for watching